The poem is called Family Change in Africa. We have survived it all. Wrong definition, self-definition, redefinition, crack up, break up, make up, break down, remake, translate, reassemble, and redefine again, stretched and strained. The original global village transported, we made the modern world at the moment of our collective unmaking. Fragmented, racinated, detribalized, searching another kind of freedom. Stretched and strained, we search for ties to reassemble definitions and redefine assemblages. Patrifocal, matrilineal, tribalistic. Matrifocal, patriarchal, westernized, none of the above, all of the above. Stretched and strained, in new urban spaces, we reinvent ourselves and scandalize the neighbors. In Kaduna and Bamako, and from Paris to New London, we reconceive peer groups, sex roles, community, and rights now taboo. Stretched and strained from Shabins to shanty towns and high courts to world assemblies, we reformulate codes and reform the law. Reconceiving family ties, kinship, community, and those rights now taboo, stretched and strained. What concepts? Polygynous, polyandrous, polyamorous, just too much sex. Masculine, feminine, transgender, just too many children. Rethink gender, rethink power, consider gender power, consider gender, consider power, rethink gender power, transnational, intergenerational, globalized, stretched and strained, but not broken, stretched and strained, but not broken, towards a different kind of freedom. I'm Abuna Busia, and I am a board member of the Women's Learning Partnership.